In this video, I'm going to teach you how to connect Razer headset to Synapse. It's a very easy process, so make sure to follow along. In this video, I'm going to give you easy to follow instructions on how to properly set up your Razer headset or any other Razer peripheral that you have and connect it to Synapse. So regardless of the headset or any other peripheral model that you purchase, they should all be detected within Razer Synapse, which is the Razer software where you will be able to control all of the settings related to the Razer peripheral or accessory that you purchased and you will be able to control everything. So all that you have to do is download Razer Synapse. During the time that I'm recording this video, they actually released Razer Synapse 4. So I assume most people are still running Synapse 3, which could be a reason on why it isn't getting detected. So I highly recommend that you download Razer Synapse 4. But regardless, you will be able to fix any issues attributed to the Razer headset not appearing or connecting to Synapse by repairing it. Because for the most part, as long as your Razer device is properly connected to your PC, immediately upon opening Synapse, it should appear on the list automatically. Now, if it doesn't appear, then like I said, it could mean various things. One is that the device isn't properly connected to your computer. Most Razer peripherals, including the headsets, should work right away. So if you notice that it doesn't work, even though you can customize it with Razer Synapse, you don't need Razer Synapse for it to work. So this could actually indicate a problem with the USB port where you are trying to connect the headset. So I recommend switching ports or trying a different connection method. Only when the headset gets detected, then it is going to automatically appear within Synapse. If it doesn't work, I recommend that you go over to the apps and settings on your Windows PC, look for Razer Synapse, click on it, and then choose the option to modify. This will allow you to repair Razer Synapse, so hopefully by doing a repair, it is going to fix any issues attributed to the headset not getting detected, because this should be automatically done as soon as you open the latest version of Razer Synapse. I hope I was able to help you on how to connect Razer headset to Synapse. If this video helped you, please be sure to leave a like and subscribe for more very easy tips. Thank you for watching.